welcome to another episode of Fit Fun. <laughs> Today's tip is how to lose weight by just drinking water. It sounds simple enough, right? But most people aren't drinking enough water. Did you know that there's like a science to this? Like, yes, there is an equation. If you're someone that doesn't like to drink water, and I know a lot of people that actually don't like to drink water, and you add water into your diet, you will see results. You will lose water weight within like the first week or two. In addition to diet and exercise, of course, water isn't some type of magical liquid. Just Drinking the adequate amount of water that your body needs alone will help jumpstart your weight loss. It'll help you shed all the water weight that your wa your body is holding on to and retaining thinking, oh my God, this is all the water we're gonna get. So then once you start feeding your body more water and start drinking it and guzzling it down, it's gonna realize like, okay, we have enough and we can start shedding what we've been holding on to. And it sounds kind of like counterproductive. It's like, okay, to lose water weight, you need to drink more water. When your body is not getting enough, it's gonna hold on to it and retain it. And that's what causes puffiness, and that's what causes bloating. And so when you start drinking more water, your body starts releasing it. And that's when you see the drop in pounds from the water weight. And you'll start to see the decrease in bloating, and you'll start seeing the decrease in puffiness, and you'll start seeing the tightness in your skin. Your next question is probably, well, how much water am I supposed to drink then? And that's a good question because it's different for everyone. It's not like a one size fit all. The equation is half your body weight in ounces. If you're a 200 pound person, then you do 200 divided by two, and that'll give you 100 ounces. And that's a good place for you to start. If you have a higher activity level, then of course drink more. If you feel like you're so thirsty for whatever reason, if it's hot, then of course drink more. You can't go wrong with drinking more water, but that's a good place for you to start. I personally, I drink this. This is um, a whole gallon, and I try and drink at least like one, one and a half, like on a good day. I know you've seen people like walking around with these, and I am that person, so don't judge me. Once you start doing this and you see the results, you won't judge them anymore. You won't laugh at them like, oh, why are they walking around with that big water jug all over the place, like walking around like it's their child. Once you start doing it, you see the results, you'll understand and you'll be walking around with your water jug like it's your child too. So the more you drink it and the more you get it down, the easier it'll become and the more you'll actually crave water and the more you do it, it'll become like your set standard. Like you won't really drink anything less than that. And then once you do drink less than that, like if you have a bad day, you'll be like, oh my God, I, I didn't drink my water today. Here are three tips to help get down that water and to help start you off so you can jumpstart your weight loss and get the adequate water that you need. Okay, here's tip number one. Using a jug like this, it'll help you to be consistent because you have a visual goal. If you're carrying it around all day, then you see like, oh my God, like I only drank like a sip of this right now, so I need to finish the rest. And then you also notice these right here. So just using a Sharpie, I just like to put marks on the side of the bottle. And this really helps like to just give you a visual aid to see exactly where you need to be. Um, some people put times, like for example, I can start off my day at say like 7 o'clock. So the first one I'll be 7 a.m., the second can be like 8 a.m. You can be as creative as you want with these, it doesn't have to be a time, but um, some people enjoy doing that. Some people like putting who their favorite celebrity is or who their body goal is, or you can put like your own personal like body part goal, it's totally up to you. Tip number two, drink water as soon as you wake up. Like first thing, just take a glass, drink it. Even before you do anything, brush your teeth, whatever, drink water. I like to keep a, a bottle of water next to my bed stand so that as soon as I wake up, I can just twist it open, drink it, and then go on with the rest of my day. If it's cold, then even better. If you have to go run downstairs or whatever and get a glass of cold water, it always helps me to go to the bathroom. I don't know if that's mm -hmm. TMI or not, but if you have time for that, that's even better. <laughs> Tip number three is to drink a glass of water with every meal. Of course, this is in addition to eating a healthy meal, having smaller portions anyway. 
We drink a glass of water with every meal. It helps you to feel fuller without having to eat as much food. And it also aids with digestion as well. So it's just a good thing to do. I also, of course, have articles down below of where you can read and find your own information. Of course, I always say to go vet this information yourself. Don't just take it from me. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if this helps you or any of my other tips help you. I'm going to keep them coming. So like, comment, and subscribe, please. I love you guys, and I'll see you next week. Bye.